After three years of a deepening cost of living crisis, so many people are beyond breaking point. Driven deeper into poverty, more and more people across Australia are in urgent need of a helping hand to keep a roof over their heads, put food on the table and pay their bills. Every day, families are facing impossible choices, but as Christmas approaches, those choices are even starker. For many, there'll be no lights on the tree because their electricity has been disconnected. There'll be no special meals because there's rarely enough food on the table and no presents because the rent is overdue. They are families just like Tanya's who are struggling with the devastating cost of living crisis as well as the extra financial and social pressures that Christmas can bring. Mum to 13 year old Jensen and eight year old twins Ella and Brooke, Tanya grew up in a disadvantaged and abusive household where she was often hungry and had to go without. Tanya vowed that her family wouldn't face similar struggles, but despite her determination, Tanya found herself in desperate circumstances. Her marriage fell apart when the twins were just nine months old and Tanya was left alone to look after her young family. Tanya was also living with severe, undiagnosed mental health conditions and without medication or support, she struggled immensely. But when Tanya started a new relationship, she felt like her luck was changing. However, she found herself trapped in a toxic relationship, enduring physical and emotional abuse while her mental health conditions worsened. A notice to vacate their rental property finally gave Tanya the opportunity to break free from the cycle of abuse. She moved into a share rental, but this too proved to be unstable and unsafe for her family. Unable to work due to her declining mental health and faced with the rapidly rising costs of living, Tanya and her children were facing homelessness. Desperate and frightened for her children's future, Tanya found the courage to seek help and through the hard work of our dedicated volunteer members, Tanya was able to find emergency accommodation and start rebuilding her family's life. Thanks to the kindness and generosity of caring community members like you, the St Vincent de Paul Society were also able to provide Tanya with food hampers, a helping hand with mounting bills, critical medication and the support to manage her mental health. Your kindness will help the Society's local volunteer members remain on the front line to help those in our community who are beyond breaking point and needing urgent relief. Your kind gift can help ensure there's food on the table, the lights are on, there's fuel in the car, people are not missing out of vital medications and healthcare, and there's a roof over their heads. Please give generously to help give vulnerable people the break they need right now. Your gift will be not just for Christmas, but for a brighter future. You'll find donation envelopes in the pews, the foyer, or ask your congregation St Vincent de Paul Society member. On behalf of families like Tanya's and many others who are struggling to get by each day, thank you.